I recently watched The Iron Lady, in which Meryl Streep plays Margaret Thatcher, uh, the British Prime Minister of the 1980s. Um, and one of the things that really interested me and sort of grabbed my attention was the scene in which she took, and I'm not spoiling anything here, where she took uh, elocution lessons. She was, I believe, from Lincolnshire, um, not really the north of England, but north enough, I suppose, to be considered not south in England. And she had a uh, pronounced, I guess, Midlands um, accent. And uh, to get ahead in politics, she took lessons uh, to allow her to speak like a clipped southern English person. Now that interested me because I remember thinking at the time, why would she do that? What's wrong with the way that she already spoke? I could understand what she was saying, although having said that, I lived in the north of England for a while. Um, but as accents go, hers wasn't terribly strong. The Lincolnshire accent, my knowledge of it, uh, it's not terribly uh, thick. Um, and by the same token, a, um, a Scot or a Welshman would probably get angry if anyone suggested that they do the same thing, i.e. talk like a Londoner, talk like the Queen, speak the Queen's English here, uh, because uh, they have their own dialects, their own brogues, the Welsh and the Scottish version of English. And to be fair to the English, the English wouldn't even expect a Scot or a Welshman to learn to speak clipped English, the Queen's English. Um, but the expectation did seem to be there that someone from the north of England should. Now that's interesting. It's a little bit of trivia that fascinated me. Um, and I don't really know if it's true or not. And I don't know if I'm making that accurate an, an analysis of the English mind. I.e., it's okay for a prime minister to speak with a thick Welsh accent. David Lloyd George did way back in the early 20th century. And not that long after him, about 20 years later, Ramsay MacDonald, who had a thick Scottish accent, um, both of them took heat for their accents, but no one said that you know, they were somehow, they, they ought to be corrected for uh, the way that they spoke. Whereas, the assumption is, certain English accents, particularly those from the North, need to be fixed. I wonder what um, my English uh, subscribers might have to say about that. Thank you.